Again, they're going to face Ulsan, whoever is going to do it. We are in the arena underground. And Again, this is, yeah. uh, you do not want to be <laughs> on the receiving end of the bright lights. <laughs> no, no, no. And that's what they do on this stage. They realign as well to try and get that. And already a low block on the sidestep wall from Arsan Ash. All right, here we go. Starting things off. And it... Again, you know, the power crush there to stuff things out. That's been the story of today and a beautiful sidestep from Morgan. We're going to see so many high-level stuff, you know, for both <laughs> these players. That's going to add up here. And the, the crazy thing is, you know, with the power crush, and I know we were just talking about it specifically, you know it's coming, but sometimes you just can't stop it. That's how exactly. great Arsene Ash is with that tool. Oh, beautiful duck there as well. This is a big, big chance here, and he gets the shoulder, gets the round. You know, winning Tiger Uppercut is all about making that statement as well. Such a great tournament, you know, around here in the world. And if they win this, you know, it's a big statement going into the global final. So both these guys will definitely want to make it all the way to the end. Yeah, you got to remember, talking about consistency as well, Arsene Ash had a rough start on the TWT. Mm. However, he won the biggest Tekken tournament of all time. Mulgold ended up winning two Master events here as well. These guys obviously know a thing or two about winning. But again, only one of them can move on. This is the loser's bracket. Yeah, let's see what he does here. Using a down jab there to stuff out any options. Down back one plus two. He's going to be looking to use his heat here. Four, oh. three. And he caught him with the smash. And just like that, we are tied up. Yeah, this is going to be a very close game. It's small margins, small errors that will dictate the game. And he started off the round before with sidestep four. And Arsene Nash took that information. And now he's going to get punished very heavily for it. Oh, yeah. I like that dash divine here just to be able to extend the combo a little bit further. Let's see what he got. He does have a decent life lead here. Both players still having access to heat. Oh my god, unlucky with a whip punish there. Both players looking for any small whip ooh, and a beautiful ooh, ooh. duck there into the big launcher here. Yeah, big launcher. He's going to get the wall break as well. Running two. No, he decides to keep him there for the extra damage. Oh, and that's what you were talking about yeah. before, Mark, man. You said it. This is going to hurt. He should be able to get the kill here. Oh. No, oh, he's pixel still alive. Minus. He's still alive. He had a pixel left, but it doesn't matter. He's able to clean the plate here. Two rounds to one. Mogul looking to get the early lead here. Yeah, for all the viewers watching at home, you're seeing some extremely high level, the highest of Tekken here. Nice. He switches positions here. Yeah, just utilizing that down forward one to stop from Mogul from moving. And yep. again, Arslan Ash, oh. his use of that down forward one to really create opportunities for other moves like that right uppercut. Okay, this could cannot be... be stressed just how hard that is oh. to be able to do that to every single player that he goes up against. Mm. He does it to everyone. Yep. Terrorizes absolutely everyone here. And Mulgo activating heat back against the wall. All right, this could be big. Sights at four. Is he going to do it again? Oh. Goes for the big blow. Big block and a big punish here from Arslan Ash. Oh, this uh -oh. is out though. That's He's touching forward. What's he looking for? What's he looking for? Oh, oh my, my god. god. And he got him with the Rage Yard. Mulgold clearing game number one. Yeah, that was all about timing right there. He was dashing forward. He was waiting for Mulgold to press something at the right time as well. You know, Arsene Nash decided to press something and Mulgold retaliated and took the round. But Arsene Nash has been in this situation many, many times where he loses the first game. Yeah, he honestly, he gets more and more dangerous the harder things are for him. Yeah. He's in the loser's bracket, man. And you know what? He has nothing to lose. What if he just goes crazy and starts going super offensive? What are you going to do then? <laughs> his, we know his defense is crazy. No one's ever going to know that. But we never, we rarely get to see him go in and open somebody up offensively. Yeah, maybe this is what he needs to do in order to be, uh, you know, what's his name? Uh, uh, Mulgaard here. Yeah. I mean, we, we know the offensive capabilities of a character like Nina. Yeah. Not only is she great at punishment, but she has so many offensive tools. She could really open up her opponent. Yeah, it looks like Mogo is making such good reads, though. Everything seems to be working out for him. Nothing is working out for Arsenal Nash, but a great punish there. A beautiful little backdash there from Mogo as well. Yeah. He seems very confident in the way that he's moving. Look at that. Just yeah. nonstop attacks here, keeping him at the wall, looking to close things out here. Oh, oh it was huge. just enough. Yeah. yeah, really good damage there. By Mogo, two more rounds and he sends Arsenal Nash home here. Okay, good punish, good block. Yeah, it just seems like Arsene Nash is like always on the back foot here. Mogo is just pushing him to the wall, just always pressuring him, pressing loads of buttons, but safe buttons. I think that's just a testament as well to Mogo. Obviously, very comfortable in the character player matchup right now. He is not afraid. He is not scared. 
Oh, good stuff by Arsenal Nash, just utilizing the power crush really well there. Down forward one, catching Mugold's timing. Arsenal Nash fighting back here. You gotta remember that first game was very, very close. Could have gone either way. Arsenal Nash now starting to utilize that jab. He was. He How was stuck times? on representing that down forward one a lot, yeah. but man. Oh man, he missed the combo. Right, he's taking a bit more risk now. You saw him going for the low, and that's gonna be big damage here. Let's see what a combo is like though from Mugo. No. He should be able to get the follow-up here. He goes for the damage instead. Yeah, opts to take the wall positioning. Here comes Arslan. Big shot, big opportunity. He's healing a little bit of life here and there. He could have gone for the low in that situation. Bad the... breath. Down foot one. Oh my god, which the grab is a beautiful punish on the low. Down foot one, two times to take that there. Arslan has fighting back. I love how Arslan has been playing a lot of these matchups, especially towards the end of the round. He has been always threatening with the wipe the floor, but this time he just did double down forward ones in his face. Yeah, exactly. A able to use that in successive fashion. You know, a lot of people, when you're one of the best players in the world, they're going to watch you. They're going to have that target right on you. But right now, the target is fighting back. Yeah, let's see what he does. Just, again, aggression from Arslan Ash utilizing that down forward one. When is he going to go for the wipe the floor? That's what we're looking for as well. Mulgold is looking for that also. He's not taking any huge oh, risk, that's that perfect! Amazing there, great use of the power crush there, the follow up here. Oh. This is big damage! Oh, wow! What's he gonna do? He goes for the mid, he goes for the knee! And this is a huge round for Mulgold. If he can take this, he will eliminate Arsenal Nash from the tournament. Uh, this is where all the, you know, all the downloads... It's gonna be, oh my god, goes for a grab there. Both players haven't actually been going for that many grabs. Oh, made the back one with... Old oh, great oh. challenger, the jab beating out oh, the blonde ball. Both players oh. grabbing now, Mark, and they're both throwing each other. Sometimes you got to do whatever it takes to wear down your opponent. Gets the float, but doesn't get the combo. Yeah, Arslan's in a good position here. Activates he. He's got the advantage. Right back at you. They're both fighting with loaded oh, guns. Oh, the down back one plus two. This is going to be huge damage. Yep. He's going to get good wall positioning. Arslan Ash, what are you going to oh, do? The wall messed up the rest of the combo. And here we go, Arslan coming in. Oh my god, this is so close! Down back one plus two gets blocked! Oh, what a block there! Oh, oh the Rage Arc! Is that gonna hit? He gets the hit! And Mogul pops off! He takes the victory! He is going to eliminate Arslan Ash from the tournament! Wow! Do you know what I was about to say? They need to be careful there with the Rage! He had Rage! The Rage Arc was a probability and he does.